We are gathered here to fill you with fear and give you a treat for your ears as we invade your mind with our scary rhymes and some tales that can be gory. As you bear witness and sit here and listen to our poetic horror stories. Hip hip hooray! You survived! You made it to the new year! You're still alive! PHS crew, I hope you have a prosperous 2022! And this new year is good to you! So let's start this year off on the right foot! Here is what I like for you to do. Like, comment, share, and subscribe! promise it's not a waste of time and why don't you click the bell and now we can commence with tonight's tales I was invited to a New Year's Eve party the invitation said bring your friends and don't be tardy so, me and my best friends were excited to go. To bring the new year and having fun, celebrating and dancing all night long. When we made it to the address of the house, the party was going strong. There were so many people there having lots of fun. Drinking, smoking, and dancing, our night has just begun. As the night went on, it was getting closer to midnight. The atmosphere changed, and it started to not feel right. Me and my best friends were feeling weird. It felt like we shouldn't be here. The partygoers' faces started to distort and change. They all started looking demonic and deranged. We tried to find a way out to leave the party. But we ran into the host who asked us, why are you trying to leave? We're only getting started. Anyway, there is no way out. All the windows and doors are now gone from this house. That's when I realized we were trapped! And we couldn't leave. There was no way back. The music was getting faster and louder. We were all dancing so hard it was getting hotter by the hour. One of my friends was finding it hard to breathe. And my other friend's feet started to bleed. We were so tired, all we wanted to do was sit down, rest, and go to sleep. We were dying of thirst and wanted something to eat. This was a real party from hell. I was so dizzy and nauseous, I wasn't feeling well. I prayed to God that this party would end. That's when I realized I lost sight of both of my friends. We were separated and they were lost in the crowd. I tried calling their names, but they couldn't hear me. The music was way too loud. I felt like the party was going on for days. And that we were never getting out of here. We had to stay. I started to think back about the invitation I received. And just like that, it hit me. What the invitation said, it reads, Hottest New Year's Eve party, don't be tardy. Our party will never end. Come party hard with us, bring your friends. We'll have so much fun, it will be a sin. Now I know the invitation was true to its words. We are trapped here in sin to party forever. This is our world. The countdown has began. Ten. This is the beginning of the end. This is a warning to you, my friend. Nine. You are running out of time. Watch your back and you will be fine. Eight, this is where you should try to escape. Don't think twice, you have no time to waste. 
Seven. If you don't leave soon, you will feel the terror. And the situation will get worse, and it won't get better. Six. He is very sadistic and sick, and this is how he gets his fix. Five. Find a way to stay alive. You must choose correctly to survive. Four. Once he catches you, he will never let you go. This is the reason you need to keep moving. Don't take it slow. Three. He won't set you free, no matter how hard you beg and plead. Two. Now that he has you, he is inside of you, and there is nothing you can do. One. He has your soul. He is one. This is the end for you. You're done. Out with old and in with the new. This is the start of a new year, 2022. Every year it starts off this way. With my New Year's resolution of change that I give up on halfway. But this year, I will follow through. And stay the course and do everything I promise myself to do. I promise you will see. New Year, new me. I have so many changes I want to do. So many fresh new points of views. I want a brand new start to my life. And I will start my change starting tonight. I mean, I've always been an awkward and shy kind of guy. Letting people use and push me around while I take the abuse and comply. But no longer for this year. I need to visualize the person I want to be. New year, new me. I will start with a gym membership to build up my strength and to become fit. I will take up running for endurance so I can breathe deeper too. So I won't have such a hard time when I chase after you. I will learn carpenters also to build traps and cages. I will meditate to expand my mind so when I stalk my victim, I can choose the right time. I need to be patient. I want to be an efficient killing machine. Yes, this is who I want to be. New year, new me. No more will I be a wimp or a nerd. You will listen to me. I will be heard. They say nice guys always finish last. But no more. That's all in the past. This will be my year. No questions asked. I will stay sturdy and steadfast. All of these new and exciting things. So much this new year will bring. My future's so bright. This feels so good to me. The time is right. I plan to be a prolific monster. Yes, you will see. I want to go down in history. All these changes, I will succeed. Like the army says, be all you can be. Cheers! Let's celebrate to the new year and the new me! Thank you for staying around and letting us entertain you with our creepy stories abound. We are here every Friday with our scary tales. This you can count on without fail. We thank you for being a fan because this year we have so much planned. But until then, thank you and come back again.